Hello everyone, Deep in Inspiration Happy here today. I'm coming to you with a new video on how to import your ATR NFT into your MetaMask wallet. So if you are part of the early note sales, I'm pretty sure you have received, I mean the NFT is now appended to the wallet that you use to buy your note license. I mean to do this, um, the instruction is quite outlined on the ATR Discord channel when you come to general and then you go to pinned messages here. The process is outlined here. So what we'll need to do is we'll need to go into our MetaMask. So when you have your MetaMask here, right, just click on the MetaMask and then you need your wallet address. And then when you have your wallet address, you go to abyscan.io and then under Abitrum One Explorer, just put in your wallet address and then click on search. Now, when this is open, you see under here you have transaction internal, transaction EL20 tokens and EL21 tokens. So when you click on this, you're going to see the NFT that is appended. So this is what you see here. It's called ATR check. And then I have my token ID. So I'm going to take note of my token ID. And then now we're going to go to MetaMask and we're going to import this. But before you import it, you will need the NFT address. So I'm going to go to the Discord channel and I'm just going to copy this specific NFT address here. Make sure that you copy this correctly. And then I'm going to go back to my Chrome. And then I'm going to click on my MetaMask. And because this is on Arbitrium, um, I would be switching. So you see that currently I have Ethereum Linear and I have Arbitrium 1. If you do not have Arbitrium, just go to Add Network. And then you would see um, Arbitrium listed here. You can just click Add. In my case, I already have this. And that's why I do not have the option to add the Arbitrium again. So under MetaMask, um, like I said, you have selected now your Arbitrium Network, right? Arbitrium 1. And then you go to, so you see we have tokens, we have NFT, and then we have activity. When you select NFT and you scroll down, you would see import NFT. And then here, we're going to put in the NFT specific address that we copied from the Discord channel. And then we're also going to put in the NFT token ID. And after that, you're just going to click on import. So now you see I got a notification that NFT was successfully added, which means that I have been able to import um, the NFT into my MetaMask wallet. So that's pretty simple. So when you click on that, you would see um, the NFT that you bought under your tokens. You see how many tokens you have. If you come under NFT, you clearly see we have an Ethereum checker license one appended um, to my MetaMask wallet. So now I'm going to go to the next stage, how to do this on phone. It's pretty simple. You need all the, exactly these two parameters, um, the specific NFT address and then the token ID. And then you would also be able to do this on your phone. So on the phone, the principle is exactly the same. And when you open your phone, you're going to currently I have my, my MetaMask on the Polygon mainnet. So I'm going to click on this and I'm going to switch to the um, Abitrium test uh, Abitrium main chain. So as you can see here, I do not have this here, but it's pretty easy. I'm going to click on add network and then under add network, I'm going to select Abitrium one. So I'm going to add this and then I'm going to confirm the chain. Then I'm going to switch to that network. And then under here, so I'm going to click on get it. Under here, you can see I have tokens and I have NFTs and I'm going to select NFTs. And then I'm going to import NFTs. And then under import NFTs, we're going to put in the same um, specific address that we copied from the Discord channel. And under the ID, I'm going to put in the token ID that I saw from Abyscan. So I'm going to put this in. And I'm going to click on import. So I'm going to refresh this so it doesn't, if you don't see, just swipe down to load this. And then you can also see here, I have the Ethereum checker license appended to my MetaMask wallet. So this was very um, easy to do. Um, if you have any questions in setting this up, please leave this in the comment section and I'm very happy to help you. Otherwise, you can also go to the Discord channel from Ethereum and this team there is very, very helpful in helping you set this up. So thanks for watching this video. Please like the video and share it to anyone who will be interested and also subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. Thanks once again and see you in the next one. Bye.